I'm going to be showing you guys the absolute best controller settings possible in this season of Fortnite. Now, these settings helped me drop a insane 20 elimination win in the duo cash cup, which you guys will see in this video. But without further ado, let's just hop right into these settings. Now, let's start off with my controller. Now, this is the Scuff Reflex FPS. It has mouse click triggers and bumpers, as well as four back paddles. Now, I do use four paddles. I've always used four paddles. If you guys have watched me, I've had it four paddles probably since around chapter three. And I am using two regular sticks. I know some people ask if I use a raised stick or not. I use two regular sticks. Now, I will tell you guys what these paddles are bound to. So, my right paddle is bound to my jump. The paddle right above that, my upper right paddle is my sprint. My left paddle is my switch mode. So, whenever I'm going to build, that's what I click. And then the paddle above my switch mode is just my pickaxe. So, it's super easy, super simple. Honestly, these are probably some of the best paddle binds you can pick. I don't think there's any any other four paddle combination you can use in Fortnite. But with the controller out of the way, now we can get into the meat and potatoes and the juicy stuff of the controller settings. And that's the actual settings themselves. The graphics, the controller settings, the binds, everything. Jumping straight into these settings, the actual things you guys are here for. Now, the graphics settings are pretty simple. Full screen, 1920 by 1080. I do not use stretch res. I kind of have my periods where I go on and off of it, but right now I am not using it at all. Frame rate is set to 360 FPS. So that's just because my computer can handle it and I have a 360 Hz monitor. Now my brightness is 125 with a Deuteronope 3. This just kind of helps with visibility, to be honest. Like some skins are harder to see, and this kind of helps see them. Kind of just a personal preference. Now, 3D resolution, I have mine changed in the game file settings. If you guys don't know how to do that, please let me know and I will show you guys exactly how you guys want to do that. Now, textures, everything's low. Show FPS on. These are kind of personal preference if you want to show FPS or not. Now, for my audio, everyone's audio is going to be different. I'm just rocking this. I'm going to go through it quick. Not really much different here than like your audio. I am on NA Central. I do get zero ping to East, but Central is where the competitive is, so it's what I play the most. Now, I have toggle sprints on, auto open doors on, mantle activations, hold jump, hold jump. Now, hold the swap pickup. This is a setting that everyone should use. It's super, super helpful, super useful. It's probably one of the best settings ever, to be honest. It makes it so if you have a full inventory, you can hold the swap the item. Or even if you don't have a full inventory, you can hold the swap the item instead of having to drop it to pick it up and then have it in that exact slot. It's way better. Auto pickup weapons off. These are my preferred item slots. Shotguns in the first, SMGs in the second. And my very last slot is my AR. That makes it so every time I tap one of my bumpers from my shotgun, I'm on a spray weapon, which is super, super useful. Now, going down to this, I have reset building choice on. Pre-edits, I have on as well. And then my confirm edits on release is off. I do not use edit on release at all. Now, the rest of this is kind of all personal preference. You know, nothing really too crazy here. I have record replays on. Energy saving mode, you do guys want to make sure you have both of these settings off. They are not good at all for you. Now, going on over to my HUD, there's really nothing to look at here. Just kind of some basic settings. Everyone's HUD is going to be different. There's not like you have to use this kind of HUD. That's not really a thing at all. Gyro options, I say this every single time. Every time. Do not use the gyro settings, okay? All right, so now just getting back into the actual things. These are my keyboard and mouse settings. For some people that do want to know, I do play keyboard every now and again. I know this is a controller settings video, but... It's worth taking a look at just real quick. 3.8, 3.8 on a 50-50 targeting. Buildings and building and editing sense is 115, 115. These are my double movement settings. Nothing too crazy. Kind of some basic stuff there. Now, I did just recently change my keyboard binds. So I can go through these with you guys real quick. So my pickaxe is my actual mouse, mouse button. So I press it in my mouse button for it. And then my building is my wall is on my mouse. My floor is on F stairs are on my mouse and my roof is on shift and now i edit with e whereas before i used all keyboard binds if you guys do remember now jumping into what you guys really really want to see this is the actual controller settings now controller auto run and build immediately on i don't know what they do really it doesn't i don't think it matters but that's just what i use slide hold times 0 0.085 i think is perfect to get a nice match between sliding and crouching it's everyone's preference though now, jumping into the actual settings here, I use a 1.6, 1.6 build and edit. Now, this may seem low. Just work with me for a second here. Using advanced options on a 44, 46, horizontal and look vertical. Really good. I can hit every shot, fry people with SMGs. It's just absolutely probably the best settings you can use. Now, my ADS, I did increase it just a little bit, not a lot. 7, 7, 3, 3 boost. Now, normally I use a 6, 6, 3 boost. So, like I said, I didn't increase it by a lot, but it's just been helping me a little bit to counteract that recoil. Now, I am on Exponential still. Exponential is probably the best controller setting you can use. Any controller pro you can think of right now is most likely using Expo. Something about it just makes it the absolute best. And then I'm rocking a 10-10 Denzo, which is nothing crazy, nothing to really 
talk about foot controller is on you get a little extra aim assist if you use this if, if you know you know none of this other stuff matters because i don't <clears throat> i don't use it now we did talk about my back paddle so i don't really need to tell you about the exact binds i'm using but my reload and stuff is just square pretty normal and then on top of that uh, i edit with left stick i reset with l2 i confirm with r1 there's not really like any crazy settings to look at there but overall yeah those are my settings those are probably the best settings you could possibly use on controller right now so make sure you guys go put those things in try some games let me know if you win down below and without further ado watch this crazy 20 bomb win from the duo cash cup using these exact settings it is crazy oh, David, they swerved off That on one. Nice, you're the best. Do I push that little pond or no? No, no I'm gonna get the full. Alright, cool. Uh, team leader and Sandy with me, by the way. Yeah, I'm coming. They're all the way up. Yeah, I see one. Oh, I thought that was you. Where did you go? I was behind you. He just ran at me without even. Wow, nice. You win this. Okay. Wow, like. One build. Nice, good job. S, flying in. Done. Nice. Good job. There's another team. They're not real, by the way. 75 way. Done. There's one on me. Proof. Yeah, breaking the top. 100. Right it. 1 HP. Dead. Nice. I hate it when they run like that. That actually. Fine for now. Two kids in here. Face. Watch your back, watch your back. We're getting crunched right now. A little bit. 1 HP. Alright, we're getting third. Behind us, behind us. Yep. I know, I've been trying to comment the whole time. No, I know that. You good? Fuck me. Yeah, I'm jumped. They're just both trying to jump in. It's not working for well for them right now, I call. Popping a call. They might press me. Yeah, I'm reloading and coming to you. I might be dead. Dead? Nice. Stay alive. 100. Nice. He's running. Nice. Oh my. Yo, chat, clip that. Oh my god. Nice. Box. 20 HP. Okay. 13 white. He's barely breathing. Nice. 56. 34. One tops. Crack. One HP. On bottom. You're the best. Good job. Well, they have no clue what's going on. They don't even know what game they're playing right now. Crack them. Yep. Nice, bro. Good job. Fine right here. Teammate on me. Come, come, come. Only spear this good. Nice. Dead. On high. There's another kid in this box as well. He might be start running. I'm this way still, but it's it's All one right. kid on He's me. To catch up. Okay, okay. I'm just trying to catch up right now. Dead. Nice. In my box. Good. I'm good. He's 1 HP. Nice. I'm just gonna come up, to be honest. Yeah, they didn't poke at all. 88. Item 70. Nice. Place a little slower so I can get to you. I'm chilling. I'm on the kid, you hit 70. 70? Dead. Different kid in my box. 
I'm, okay. I'm just getting up and healing. He's weak. I'm weak. Dead. Nice. All solos. Just look. Just look. On me? Yeah. Okay. Full box. Come this way. Come, come, come. Over here. Right here. Bro gave up. <laughs> nice. It's only one. Right here. On me. Yep. I'm with you. I added a Drew Downs on me. One HP, one HP, legit one, legit one, just not bad, not bad. Nice, bro. Good game! Was that 33? Everything's fine.